For the first time in over 100 years, the Arizona School of the Deaf and Blind aren't sure about the future. If House Bill 24, 20, uh, 2456 rather, does not pass in the Senate, the school looks at shutting down by July 1st. News for Tucson, Zoe Zandora is live on the Tucson campus to explain. Zoe. Yeah, House, Bo House Bill 2456, if passed, allows the school to be open for another eight years. But for the first time, there's worry that the Senate won't pass that bill. Superintendent Annette Richmond says this is the first time we are having questions about the particular bill. And Annette says they have no idea why. Instead of being assigned to the Education Committee, it was assigned to the Government Committee instead. That was the first inkling we had. Something was amiss. Um, and there it sat for a number of weeks. We're finally having the hearing. It's on the agenda for this Wednesday. But we still don't know what the holdup is, what the questions are. We're hearing there may be possible amendments. We don't know what the amendments may be. students that attend these schools statewide and over 200 teachers. This will affect a lot of people in the state of Arizona. Tune in at 5 o'clock when I speak to one of those students further. Zoe Zandora, live in Tucson, News 4, News 4 Tucson.